Dr. Jacob has a patent pending for special trifines, modified care segments, and some of the other devices shown. Corneal allogenic intrastromal ring segments CARES, refers to the intra-channel placement of allogenic tissue and is used to treat corneal ectasia. As the name implies, it refers to allogenic tissue of any source that may be used in this manner and can include, among others, fresh cut CARES, unprocessed or processed CARES, preserved or packaged CARES with or without modifications and with or without storage and shelf life capabilities. CARES is traditionally used as standard, longitudinally cut, uniform thickness segments. However, we have also described customized CARES for further refining the results of CARES treatment. Customization allows the effect of CARES to be tailored to the individual keratoconus patient, providing better topographic and refractive results that are more tailor-made for each individual patient. Synthetic symmetric intracorneal ring segments, ICRS, have been used for keratoconus since many years. We too have previously described very encouraging results for symmetric, uniform thickness CARES in keratoconus with patients showing significant improvement in almost all the parameters studied such as uncorrected and spectacle corrected distance visual acuity, spherical equivalent, topographic astigmatism, maximum and steepest keratometry, best fit spheres, etc. As described previously, these are longitudinally cut allogenic segments of uniform thickness that are similar to intacts. Though we obtained good results with standard uniform thickness CARES, the possibility of tweaking the results still further by customizing CARES to the individual patient's topography and refraction was an exciting one. We therefore used customized CARES in patients with asymmetric keratoconus. This was done by shaping CARES according to their topographic and refractive needs. The uniform thickness CARES was marked and using a special CARES customizer instrument that we designed ourselves, we were able to mark the segment according to the desired optic zone and degree or clock hour. We could then cut the exact shape that was required according to the patient's keratometric gradient and then insert it intrastromally into the patient's cornea. Customized CARES includes asymmetric or symmetric, specifically shaped CARES that are prepared and these can be of progressive or variable thickness, progressive or variable width or combinations. In addition, change in shape or transition zone can be created to have sudden change or gradual taper and variations in shape or thickness may be along a defined extent or along the entire arc length. As obvious, in progressive ectasias, CARES is combined with corneal cross-linky to stabilize progression. We customized CARES by first trefining standard CARES using a special double-bladed trefine, placing the standard CARES segment on a computer-printed degree zone marker, following by marking the required arc length and transition points with a fine-tipped inked marker. We soon got this pattern stamped on an autoclavable instrument to facilitate customization surgery further. This was then placed on a flat cutting surface, for instance a Teflon block, and cut with a sharp blade using the transition marks as reference points. We found that it gave us excellent predictability with the hand-cut segments matching well to the surgical plan. We also found it easy and quick to customize once the marks were applied to standard CARES. For surgeons desiring freedom from preparing customized CARES, this could be done by an eye bank technician or in the future using the femtosecond laser. Once the customized CARES are prepared, they are inserted into femtosecond or manually dissected channels in the cornea. Just as for standard CARES, we continue to use wider tunnel settings together with shallow implantation. The usual settings we employ are an inner diameter of 4.6 mm and outer diameter of about 7.1 mm with tunnel depth programmed to be at 50% of minimum stromal thickness in zone of implantation. CARES per se has numerous advantages over synthetic ICRS. For one, the allogenic nature of the tissue decreases the risk of some of the complications associated with synthetic ICRS such as stromal melting, necrosis, intrusion, extrusion, migration, etc. If K-max is more than 58 diopters or if minimum corneal thickness at the zone of implantation is less than 450 microns or 
If the mesopic pupil size is more than 6 mm, synthetic ICRS is generally contraindicated. However, CARES can be implanted in all these situations because of the allogenic nature of the tissue. This avoids anterior stromal necrosis. A smaller optic zone, implantation of thicker segments allowing greater volume change and superficial implantation all allow greater effect from CARES as compared to synthetic ICRS. CARES also gives the ability to use smaller optic zones since the risk for photic phenomena glare and halos from CARES is low as compared to ICRS. CARES, being allogenic, would not carry the risk of corneal melt and in fact has been used by us to treat post-intact melt. A synthetic ICRS, however, even if placed at an acceptable depth initially, may still cause melt because of the synthetic nature. Progression and eye rubbing can worsen this risk further. We use the manual trephine to cut and customize CARES. Altering the distance between the two blades alters the volume of tissue cut. The femtosecond laser can also be used for creating custom cares. It can very accurately customize the arc length, the degree of taper, as well as the thickness and depth of the cares, adding exciting new possibilities in harnessing cares further. More extensive customization by varying shapes further using the femtosecond laser is being researched further. Since cares can be customized on spot, large inventories are not needed. Unlike the synthetic progressive thickness ICRS, which come in only fixed sizes and proportions, making true customization impossible. This is unlike CARES, where exquisite customization of any pattern is possible. For instance, unlike synthetic progressive thickness ICRS, we did not use uniform end-to-end -end taper, but chose the location to correlate with topographic pattern. Different customized shapes can be employed, some examples being single side taper, double side taper, central taper, connecting band shape, etc. To conclude, custom cares is an addition procedure that can be used successfully for mild to advanced cases of keratoconus and post lasic ectasia to improve topography and vision. Decrease in coma and other HOAs improves distorted vision. In combination with CXL, it can help avoid dark in many patients. The future, we believe, will see more and more use of customized cares.